eating well and losing the pounds part one okay when most people think about losing weight and eating they think about dieting well unfortunately all of the fad diets out there tend to cause people to gain weight why because they starve them to death and the person eventually breaks down and eats everything in sight because they are so darn hungry they also deprive them of the foods that they love this is not a way to lose weight nor is it a way to live you only cause yourself stress which actually causes you to gain weight so in eating right there are a few tips that you can follow each and every day and they're not going to deprive you of the foods that you love but treat those foods as luxury items so you enjoy them that much more tip number one eat fresh fruit and vegetables that have high water content these are foods like tomatoes watermelons cantaloupe kiwi grapes you get the idea all of those fresh and flavorful juicy fruits and veggies are good for you these items contain about 90 to 95 percent water so you can eat a lot of these and they will fill you up without adding on the pounds tip number two eat fresh fruit instead of processed fruit anything that is processed is more sugar processed and canned fruits also do not have as much fiber as fresh fruits tip number three increase your fiber intake as much as you can this usually means eating more fruits and veggies tip number four veggies are your friends when it comes to shedding pounds there are tons of options here and you may even want to try some you haven't had in the past the leafy green varieties are the best and you always want to work in a salad when you can salads are packed with nutrients as long as you don't pour too much dressing on and load them with too much cheese the leafy greens also have a lot of natural water tip number five be intelligent about what you eat don't eat just to eat animals eat on instinct people eat when they know their body really needs it don't be an impulse eater tip number six watch everything you consume from the food itself to what you top it with garnishments and condiments can sabotage a healthy meal because they are typically high in fat tip number seven get a handle on the sweet tooth this doesn't mean you can't have your sweets just don't eat them as a meal always remember that these sweets end up adding to an area that you don't want them to add to don't deprive yourself either though because then you'll eat twice as many as you should tip number eight set meal times and stick to them try to have your meals at specific times and eat them at that time an eating pattern will help you to control what you eat and when you eat it also it really is better to have five small meals a day rather than just one or two huge meals just eating once a day makes your body feel as though it is starving which packs on fat instead of using it as fuel also don't wait until you're starving to eat this only makes you overeat until you're stuffed tip number nine eat only when you are hungry be sure to drink a glass of water first to determine if you really are hungry or if you are really thirsty many people have the tendency to eat when they see food it doesn't mean they are hungry they just want to eat it don't eat anything you're offered unless you really are hungry if you feel you must eat it out of being polite just nibble don't have a meal tip number 10 try not to snack between meals but if you must have a snack make sure it is a healthy one if you travel a lot try to find healthy snacks and not junk food tip number 11 veggies make great snacks they can get you through the hunger pangs if you are having them carrots are great because they satisfy hunger and they are packed with nutrients tip number 12 counting calories is a good idea for those must have food items if it is a packaged food item then it will have the calories on the packaging be sure to pay attention to serving sizes in terms of calories as well an otis spunkmeyer muffin is intended to be two servings so you have to double the calories listed this is where food producers get tricky and you can't fall in their trap. Tip number 13. Work off the extra calories by the end of the week. If you feel you have splurged too much this week, be sure to get to the gym or go walking a little longer to work off those extra calories you have consumed. Tip number 14. Stay away from all things fried. If it is breaded, it is better that it is baked. Fried foods are immersed in fat and oil. Even after the excess has oil has been drained away, there is still oil absorbed into the food item itself. Tip number 15, don't skip meals. You should have, at the very least, three meals a day, but preferably five small meals. This will keep you from getting hungry during the day and overeating out of starvation. Tip number 16, just like fruits, fresh vegetables are better than those that are canned. 
It is even better if you can eat your veggies raw. When you cook them, you cook away the nutrients. If you must cook them, try to boil them to the point that there is still some crispness to them. Also, don't soak them in butter. If you can buy organic and pesticide-free veggies, that is even better. If you like the video give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends, or anyone who would benefit from the video and remember to click the subscribe button. Thank you.